Search planes leave base near Perth on Sunday to resume their hunt for missing flight MH370 in the southern Indian Ocean. But Australia's Prime Minister Tony Abbott says they now have another possible lead to go on. Uh, yesterday, one of our civilian search aircraft got visuals on a number of objects uh, in a fairly small area uh, in the overall Australian search zone. Uh, finally, the search is being joined today by four additional aircraft, two Chinese aircraft and two Japanese Orions. As with previous sightings of floating objects, there's nothing yet to connect them to the missing Malaysia Airlines jet and its 239 passengers and crew. But Abbott says the development is a cause for hope at least. It's still too early uh, to be definite, but obviously we have now had a number of very credible leads and there is increasing hope, no more than hope, no more than hope, uh, that we might be on the road uh, to discovering what did happen uh, to this ill-fated aircraft. On Saturday, China said it had a new satellite image of an object some 120 kilometres from the Australian sighting.